Welcome back to Mobile Suit Baba. I first had to take care of the game being detected as a virus and deleting itself off my system. So now we should be okay. We gotta take down the evil Mevil, the very secret villain. But this is where it ends. Because Dread Spires will definitely stop us this time. Okay, round limits different than usual five. All right, last turn. Okay, I need to win in one turn. More than zero mechs at the end? And what does Dread Spire do? I can't tell when I'm in the selection mode. And it says mech is weak behind here. And I have a selection of characters. Hmm. Let's just do Bob and Worm. Is, is it even possible to win with that? More than so, fires devastating lasers. So, okay, no, we, we, we freaking died. Um, yeah, Worm has no special abilities, so I just wanted to laugh and if, if Worm was capable of doing it. I mean, I think it's a very, it's a Fofo and Baba style level. I think that's the most obvious to me. Like, you do this, and every character has a move and a, an ability. Baba can move three squares in a turn, but can also do an action. I kind of need to reset that one to put Fofo in front. No, no, here. Okay, now Baba has a kicking ability. Targeting his thrown and slides one tile so he can get it there. Oh. <laughs> it's because the mech is weak. That's why it died right on the forest. It usually would not die on the forest. Uh, I was hoping to pull, though, because Fofo has a pulling ability. All right, let's try with some different characters. Hold on, I remember that Bird had a swapping ability. Bird can swap places with others. Okay. So, does that mean that if I kick Baba... Nope. It still died because it bumped the target, by the way. Hmm, this is trickier than I thought it would be. So, if I don't bump, then it's fine. But target unit within range of three swaps places with bird. I was hoping to swap with the word weak, but it's not gonna ha Wait a minute. I can still swap with it. And now the laser should be pointing this way. So the bird is safe. There we go. How can this be? These mechs are overpowered. This is unfair. How come Mevel doesn't join the fight themselves? We'll deal with anything you throw at us. A friend's movement. We'll rescue Commander me no matter what. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Definitely a distinct entity. It's actually a me imposter who has painted themselves purple. We're gonna find a Mevel's purple rule. Okay, changeless. Snip, snap. Sup. More friendly faces on mech suits. Remember, this is all happening at city scales. Snip, snip, ba, ba, ba. Welcome. Snip, 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 snip. All right, so if you do lava is lava, for example, it can't be transformed. That's basically the rule that's going on there. Okay, so I'm gonna play as the, I don't freaking know. <laughs> we'll play as Baba again. So what is crab's ability? Thrown over crab and turns, I see. So it throws it, it takes an object that's in front of it and throws it behind it. Now, now there's this lava is lava. No, no, I think I, I think I want to throw this crab forward so it can do the same thing. So now, zero lava's at the end. Wait. Zero lava's at the end? I can break lava is lava. Remember, we've made lava is water right here. So if I break lava is lava, it'll turn into water. But that's not good because we want the skulls to die first. So, we'll restart the mission. But this time... Hmm. I think Baba wants to go in front. I mean, we'll still do the lava's water. It just won't trigger yet. Um, maybe undo that. What I want is Baba goes in front and deals with those skulls. Now Crab can throw the skull behind itself. Getting rid of that. And then Baba can push the skull. Okay. The skull is kind of in an awkward position. I hope we can get there in time. In fact... No? Hmm. Yeah, okay, now I can use Baba to push this away one tile. Every character has this ability to push something away one tile, and then their own special ability. So this one throws it over. So I throw over the skull. There you go. Okay, and now lava's lava. We can break that easily. And there we go. Now there's no lavas and no skulls. And I unlock crab mech. Let's try the uh, fruit punch HQ. Because these bonuses can be hard sometimes. Factory, 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 ghost. Boo. <laughs> Who's there? Boo. Boo. This area is haunted. Okay, so enemies defeat. Stop at each factory with a mech. The ghost can fly towards the nearest mech and 
move really far. But do I need to break enemies defeat? I don't even think I can do that. I need to break Hilla's stop first. Okay, um, let's push the worm here. Then the worm can, uh, worm is no special ability, but can get rid of the Hilla's stop. I'm pretty sure that will also, no. Now, yeah, now the ghost can go in and do spooky things. Yeah, I don't know. So GG's, GG's other ability allows it to dash in a line, which allowed me to move and then use the GG special to move again. Okay, no. The ghost is definitely- the enemy is defeat, so this ghost is very powerful and is gonna kill us fast. So, I think we're- I think we just lost that one. GG needs to get there super fast or something. Five turns left, so maybe I could set it up so that GG can, uh, can get to go to two factories at once. Okay, so I'm not going to break Hilla's stop immediately. Pass. Okay, now push that away. Now again, Hilla's stop was broken, so this ghost can now go. But it'll first kill the worm, which is fine because we just got two, both of the factories with Gigi's normal move and then Gigi's special dash move. There we go. Good night, worm. Well, anyway, Fruit Punch HQ. Where's up? Hi there. You're now with the Oper Operation Fruit Punch Nuclear Power Facility. <laughs> oh no, the relocation. Ba ba ba. What you say? Operation Fruit Punch will be completed from space. They better have an awesome outer space finale. Game can't just tease outer space and then not not do that. The Grand Anti Fruit Satellite. All right. Well, passive effects that happen between rounds. So, each mech's position is marked, and something will happen on those spots. I have seven turns to get rid of all the factories, and the fruit will have to stay alive. Well, that should be easy. We just break through his week the first turn, but... Hmm. We, have, we can select four allies. We can... Sure, we'll, we'll decide... Fofo, it, that's completely arbitrary. Okay, now, let's break through his week. We pretty much need to do that. So... Death? Is that the effect? Okay, so... Bob... <laughs> Empty space to behave as they were solid walls, okay. Oh, you could have told me that before. Otherwise, just like avoiding where you previously were would have been just easy. Okay, I think this crab doesn't want to be on the weak tile. Wait, zero factories at the end. Uh huh. Wait, that's that's hmm. zero factories at the end. We also have some robots that we need to be wary of, probably because they might push us around. Yeah, they will. Okay. The problem is going to be that with the robots pushing us around, and I mean for for the factories, I believe we just need the beam to st we just need to stand on the positions that are on factories by the end of the turn. We just got rid of one robot. I don't know if I can get rid of others, which I hope to do. Can I make it work? Do. I don't know. I kind of feel like I'm not going to succeed at doing so. I can do that. Okay, and now I've, I've got rid of a factory successfully in that empty square. But I, I want to get rid of the robots. Or maybe I just like throw this robot. I can, I can target this robot and throw it way behind so it doesn't get in the way. Okay. So now the previous death square is hard to see, but the death square is here and here. And Baba, where do you go? I don't want the crab to, to get kicked, but there's not really where else, not a great place to go, really. Hmm. Okay, now, now what? Just do that. Okay. And now, three turns left should be plenty. Maybe I'll just like make play it safe and kill the robot right now. I can't do that by pushing it in. Now, push Baba over. And there's no more robots to get in the way. There's only like two factories left. Oh, it's gonna die. Well, rest in peace, it. Last turn. And, oh. <laughs> Tell the fruits. How did the fruits die? Oh my gosh. Well, I guess the I guess guess the dread spire is the real vaporizer, huh? 
I guess the way to get more than... So, what's gonna... I, ugh, damn it. So, when I do that, the fruit dies anyway, because fruit is weak was not the reason they died. You know, Baba, how did Baba react with that face when the Baba doesn't exist? Anyway, so all that really means, though, is that we need to make lava is fruit because we can't save the fruit. So we need to do lava is fruit to get fruits back. I wonder if an empty space can block the laser of a dread spire. I'm not looking forward to the amount of babysitting I'm going to have to do with the robots. Like, I think I want a puller. Yes, I am now caring about the party members. Like, I love Gigi. Maybe Baba. Okay, these are like... I'm just using like the best I can think of right here. So we do that to prepare for lava's fruit, except we don't want that immediately, of course. If it goes in front, it's here. So, GG. Oh shoot! I didn't want lava's fruit to go that far, honestly. But whatever. Yes. So I, I'm, I'm the Fofo's position here in, in like, because I want the, like, I don't know if I can even trick it into moving into the lava. Apparently that does. Mm. Okay, so Crab, you can probably just like safely go there. I, I use GG to slowly move this lava's fruit up. I mean, I, I hope I have the turns for this because I was spending a lot on nonsense. And good night, robot. <laughs> Uh, this lava's defeat's not in a good spot either, because I, I can't multi-push. Okay, once again, I'm going to try to throw this out. Ofo, move fruit. Ah, that's such a bad spot to move fruit. Okay, I, I redid the turn, so we can do that instead. Now the other robot's gone, though. Okay, all robots are off. Meaning I don't need to worry about any of the robots anymore, but... I need to be very careful with what I'm doing with lava's defeat, for instance, because I want it out. I can make lava's fruit, which is what I wanted to do, but I'll need to uh, hope to get all this stuff done over here. Okay. All right, now let's get this more defeat out of the way. It turns left. And I think that's all of the factory. Wait, no. No, no, this is really all of the factories. What do you mean Gigi dies at the end? Oh, I just realized that um, we could we could have technically pulled this over to destroy factories as an alternative means to destroy factories. But okay, hold on, last turn. And sorry, GG. We've cornered you, Mevel. And this nonsense. What's that machine behind you? Well, you are busy not saving the fruit and turning the lava into the fruit. All right, space plants. A tingle with snail moons rockets. Why is Snail the owner of rockets? Okay, extra objectives. Oh my gosh, of course. Team challenge for the challenge objectives. <laughs> ah, what it like? Oh gosh. Maybe you should just do the main game and then we'll deal with the extra stuff. Uh, bonus, 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 space. Windy Reef. Forestry. All right, forestry, bonus. Hardcore logging. I don't see any fruits or foes around. Great use of time, Keck. What? I love landscape. Okay. Rule force is force is always active. What do you mean? It's, it's... But it's not active. Well, uh, I guess it just means the force doesn't transform into water, huh? Okay, force to sink water's unit. So water is unit. That means that I can push it around like a unit. I'm sure we're like what we really want to do though is swap it around. So I don't know. It's kind of awkward. <laughs> like, it's like, I, okay, nice that it can do that and dash and push the water away. All right. Felt like a very inefficient first turn, but I did though. The so Fofo can pull the forest to sink away. So you can do that. I don't know. I, I, I want water is sink. The forest is unit, I think. You can get that slowly there. Mm. I can do that swap with water. So now water is sink, and now we just need forest as unit. Except, um, I don't know, all our characters kind of move slow too. I'd love Keki to come in there and kick all the forests away. We should have pushed the water into the forest instead of the other way around. I don't, I don't, I don't think we're going to make it. It can go further. Oh no, it can't. Damn it. Yeah, I don't know. So there's forest as unit. And yeah, the idea is basically to push the forest into the... The unit also counts as solid, so it can't move through there. Let's just restart this. So... 
That, that got rid of the water, not the other way around. If anything, I would think you would want the water just the one before the uh, forest. Okay, so if I do that, it'll switch through action. I can... Oh, but it could also go way further back there. Yeah, it's dash is something that I, uh, I've probably been undervaluing. I'm gonna push this out too. Alright. Okay, so once again, we want to pull that. Shut up, Fofo. Stop blocking the everything. Okay, so now I can- because we broke forest to say I just put the water there directly, seems more efficient there. I can actually go switch with water, almost switch that right now. Okay, so now we can set up, uh, please move here. Forest to sink, there we go, we got, got something already gone. So, when I do forest as unit, I, I was- I'm kind of wondering what happens if you force as unit when you're standing on a forest. Okay, let's just go here and then dash, knocking it in there. Then when we do water to sink next turn, they'll be very, very good. We can actually do it n immediately, though. Not sure if we can do everything in time. I, I, I see that I can even do, like, water to sink this turn. Let's kill the fofo. -fo. <laughs> well, it looks like a disaster, but let's just see how close I was anyhow, anyway. Probably not that, actually. This keke is still annoyingly far. I don't think we can do it in time. Uh, I was thinking about swapping this, though. Alright. Okay, so I just... On the first turn, I can break... Forest to sink, then start shoving water into the forest like that, and that looks really good to me. I don't know how much we can uh, get this idea, but it feels good. Well, I like, I like to push the bird in to make water is sink at the right time, and then Keke can start pushing a lot, which is great. Right, so this goes here. Keke can make another push from here into here, here to here. Not sure what it is going to be doing here. Maybe it can go there, knocking knocking it over. Then Kanga can go again once again, pushing that water into the into that far slot. All right, three turns left, and I can swap this with this for water is sink. I need to swap force this unit next turn, and then hopefully, although I hope it's easy as well, I could go here and kick Keke over. Just move Keke over, over again. So move that there. Okay, now I can go here. I can push. No, further! No, hold on. Um, okay, we can switch the forest unit. And Keke is now standing on a forest, which is kind of fun. Anyway, I think this is actually failing, because Keke can't- Keke really needs to push a forest into a water this turn. Here. Here. Okay, look at this. It can go here, and then push, and then make an earthquake. Then swap. Swap for I just swapped the forces unit, so now the force is pushable into the water. Next turn, and this looks like a win. Just needs this one to be pushed here and here. Push the forest. Boom. Very nice. Yeah. Nice waterscaping. Glass cannonage bonus. What's a glass cannon, Baba? Hi, Skull. We're here to stop it from stealing fruit, Baba. <laughs> There's no fruit. Da. Skull still wants to delay stuff. Uh, wouldn't that be fun? Baba. Rule mech is weak is always active, so I will... All the mechs... Wait, but mech is safe, though. I wanna... Hmm. Okay, Baba. Okay, okay, you're, you're the characters that were in the intro. So, zero skulls... Care, zero skulls, though. Uh, okay, so... Because mech is safe, that just works. So far. Even though Mech is weak is always active, Mech is safe overrides it. But what is this defeat thing? Hmm. Am I, was I supposed to try to make Mech is defeat? Because defeat objects can kill other objects. Easily-ish. It also looks like a cross formation level. Right, let's, let's just see how this goes. We kick this into place. Ba 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 ba. But we don't have many turns to do this though. Maybe Keck should go back, like behind there. Then I push that. Oh, no. Oh, I push it in this column. Keke can go here. I am not gonna have the turns, am I? Because what I'm trying to do is set up Mecha's defeat right here. Which, which doesn't even activate for long enough before it gets kicked. And even if I did make Mecha's defeat, I would need to touch every skull afterwards. So that's not gonna work. I should have launched it over, like. Like here instead. Oops. So here, 
And then I launch... No, that's gonna hit a... Yeah. What if this is one of those levels that's impossible with certain character configurations? Or maybe I was overcomplicating. And you can knock this over. If the skull's in the way, that could actually work. Maybe just pass and... And, uh... Knock... Use, use Baba to knock Keke past the defeat text. This is still very slow. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be able to make Mecha's defeat at this point. Oh, but maybe defeat should have... No, defeat can't come first. <sighs> Shoot. I'm going to bump that far target. So... I... didn't even do anything. I can do this. That was very bad. That's so inefficient. Yo, know, what the? Why is me in the team? How did that happen? <laughs> Look, all I know is that the, the mech and defeat are in such bad positions to start with that we can't easily make it. So I... Let's just let's just do the, the, the great thing, which is clearly... Die. Oosh. Die. No, we don't have it. Oh well. Die. Boosh. Fantastic. So that's that's one level that we're probably gonna consider the extra objective and something like that later. <laughs> There's some areas at the back as well. Windy Reef. Sure. Look, islets. What do you? Yes, there's cubes. Wasn't there a level where he destroyed all the cubes? One must not waste one's cubes. We're a very cube-friendly society. Anyway, water is sink is always active. All units are pushed down left every turn. What exactly is that? Okay, it's, 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 sure. More than four cubes at the end. That seems difficult. Every cube is like on a countdown clock. Not many places that are safe. Like I, I see this would be safe. I mean, more than four cubes. That means five. So I only, okay. So two cubes can die. <laughs> you know, I, I want that to be Baba so I can kick that in here. And four turns left is actually quite a lot of time. Not sure what I want to do with the other ones. And four turns is so much that this cube right here will just stay alive. I think it will not fall in the water. One, two, three, four. Uh, I'm playing with freaking bird and worm right now. So... Because I don't know, I'd have no idea for the other characters. I can do that, and I can use Baba again, actually. If I could, ooh, that's also an interesting idea. I mean, but like... Alright, so... I can easily do that, just to bring an object, just to continually push a box, keep a box there. I need more than four, though. I don't think I'm actually getting getting it here. Maybe I am, hold on. If I babysit this box... Oops, I got bird killed. <laughs> <laughs> and Baba killed. That's not a successful babysit. Um, so was Baba even able to get there in time? If it was, that'd be great. Hmm. Like, what I was thinking before was that, oh, it would be nice if we could do that. And then do a swap. Which saves this box for good, but unfortunately kills Bird. There's no way to rescue this anymore. So, I was thinking maybe the Foof and Jeej can come here. So, this idea is, well, first of all, of course, Baba does that. But Jeej comes and quickly gets over here and babysits this box. And I was thinking Fofo's magic pushing ability would allow some level of babysitting of this box, but then fix this box when it comes time to do that. Or alternatively, is it possible for Baba to switch positions with Fofo? Why does Jeej keep dying? Okay, remember to stay alive. <laughs> while you're doing whatever you're doing. So don't- so never be in a space that's one above the water. Okay, we still have all cubes alive. Push this out. Now I want Baba to switch positions with that. Or Baba can actually push over there, but I don't think that part is necessary. The whole point of this is just so that uh, Fofo can go and pull this to the safety square. Okay, now Fofo's gonna die, but you know, whatever. All right, there we go. I can't wait to do the team challenge for that one. This is what that's apparently named. The opposite. Oh, gosh. Okay, Dread Area. I wish I could help the Baba Defense Force somehow. What? Yes, you can fit in the middle. Amazing. Fewer than six Dread Spires at the end. Okay. Um, with only regular pushes. These don't have any other special abilities, but 
these uh, Dread Spires do look in certain directions. So it is possible to get them to sacrifice each other. Like there, those are now sacrificing each other. It's hard to know where the hell these things are pointing. Like that's- I'm pretty sure that sacrifices the worm. It doesn't? Well, there we go. Um, okay. We can do that as well. Pushing this in, and then push this. So uh, these are now facing each other. He turns left, huh? We push this in here. Now that one will target that. Okay, that worm's definitely dying if I don't do anything though. So maybe fix it. Now we have six. If we are able to kill one of them in two turns, that's a win. And I mean, let's do this, right? There we go. Fewer than six. That was a job well done, wormies. Okay, one more flood. Ba 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 ba. That's not quite how it works. <laughs> Is Baba doing math with Boz? <laughs> Hold up. Okay. More than zero mechs at the end. Does a robot count as a mech? I kind of forgot. And, and they're gonna be overwhelming. Enemy is more. Seriously. Um. How are we going to survive any of this? Hmm. I can sacrifice others, I suppose. Um. Ma? Bah! Bah! Look, we got, a, we got a lot more than zero mechs. I don't know what you're talking about. Damn it. So no, robots are not mechs. Duh. Is, is Fofo just gonna stop the production? That seems like a way to do it. So I, I, want, I would like to know if it's possible with a different kind of team set up. Oh. <laughs> um... Yeah, they still move despite not being a feat, huh? I mean, maybe we need Worm as bait. Then we do the same thing. And all I care about is Kek, so... Like, all I care about is the kicking ability. So what we do here is... Uh, move that. But I hope that it doesn't get... I hope it doesn't get, get to Fofo, please. Please, please get baited by us. Oh wait! No, no, that works because we... Okay, I, I was smarter than I thought. Because I destroyed enemy as defeat instead of enemy is more first so now we're now they're pretty much harmless there you go where was i i don't know you weren't used what <laughs> you were in the process of explaining the intricacies of fruit production pipeline <laughs> Ba. How do you say colon, close parentheses, and then grow three eyebrows, one for your mouth? Anyway, that leaves just space left. And that's gonna be for next time. Also ignore the screen.